and to matters health. And now the free maternity services by the national government lauded by many as a significant step towards improving maternal and child health indicators have now been transitioned to the Mama Linda program to be run by NHIF. Some counties now have their own health financing programs running. Adding Linda Mama to the counties gives Kenyans options to choose from, which is the focus of this week's Health Digest by Dr. Masi Kurir. Mothers being detained in hospitals over medical bills is not news in Kenya. Because of such possibilities, some mothers would opt not to deliver in hospital. This, however, could have been easily cured with the introduction of the free maternity program by the national government and implemented by the county governments. The program has been a big success uh, in most counties and uh, we have uh, indeed been delivering free maternity services from antenatal care uh, to delivery and postnatal care uh, without uh, charging our clients. The high cost of health care has always been a prohibitive factor for many mothers. Several counties, in addition to the national programs, have introduced their own local programs for mothers. Makueni with its universal health cover and Kakamega with Imarisha Afya Mama na Mtoto are examples. Kabla ninge kwa imurati ya Imarisha Afya na Mama, nilikuwa na maisha ngumu sana. Nilipo pata mimba ya u mtoto wangu, nikaenda kwa uh, Imarisha Afya ya Mama na Mtoto, nikaingia kwa kompyuta. Enyeo nili, nili attend kliniki zote. Nilipo jifungua, nilipo fika siku ya kuchifungua, nikaenda hospitali. Kajifungua, wakanilipia, nikatoka huko. Wapo nyuma ilikuwa ngumu. Unajifungua hata mtoto, mzee ana kitu, hata tawe la kuna. Hasa ilikuwa ngumu tu, labda mama kusaidie, ama penyume toka, wazazi wako kusaidie. These are mothers from Kakamega who have benefited from the County Maternal Child Health and Family Planning Act of 2017, whose purpose is to curb maternal and child mortality. This program will be able to deal with maternal issues that he is now dealing with. It will, it will be able to deal with family planning. And thirdly, it will be able to deal with poverty eradication. The county reserves 3% of its annual health budget for Imarisha Afia Mama Namtoto Initiative. Each pregnant and lactating mother receives cash transfers of up to 12,000 Kenya shillings in the first 1,000 days after delivery. And in Makueni County, mothers delivering there are a happy lot. Makueni Kenda Clinic, Bando Wanakuru. Lakini kujifungua ni kajifungulea Makueni County under the Universal Health Care Card ya Bwanangu. Ambayo the services are free and chenye uh, tumu tu anaitajika ni kununua the basic. Kwa wakati tumeenza kuenda clinic, sijaeza kulipa clinic pesa yoyote. Ile nimeza kuwa naenda government hospital na nimeza kuwa niki, nikitibi wa bure. Mimi natumi ya kibudha, situmi na HF. Ukija. Hakuna chenye unalipa, unaudumiwa vizuri, ukisha jifungua chakula iko, hata niwe mwenye unashindwa na kula. But all is not well for counties implementing the Linda Mama program. Information about this program is not clear to the service providers. In the month of July, uh, the transition to Linda Mama uh, program, which is now... Uh, an insurance, NHIF-based insurance program uh, for all pregnant mothers. We have noticed that uh, there have been substantial challenges. There has never been a, a, a proper dissemination of this program to the county governments so that all of us as CECs, as uh, implementers of this program, uh, we are clear uh, on the modalities of the program. The transition to Linda Mama, according to Dr. Mulwa, has seen counties starved of funds. Up to 
July 2017, the national government has been reimbursing county governments uh, the compensations for the cost of deliveries that have taken place. NHIF uh, in the local branch have not have been against the reimbursement for other services other than delivery. So we are asking ourselves, uh, who is covering ANC services? Where a mother gets, uh, a, 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 it delivers, and the child, for one reason or the other, has complications that need admission or need to hospital stay. Who is going to cover? The initiative to offer maternity services under a social insurance scheme is one that overcomes the barrier of affordability of these services by many Kenyan women. While a lot still remains to be done to improve statistics on maternal and child health, bridging the monetary gap is a sigh of relief for many families. Dr. Masikorir, for Health Digest, KT News. Well, uh, more on that on uh, Health Digest in the second part of Weekend Prime exclusively on KT News with Dr. Masi Korid. But that brings us to another short break here on Weekend Prime. Do stay with us. It's still to come. <laughs>